Plummer Vinson syndrome Plummer Vinson syndrome is a condition characterized by a triad of dysphagia, esophageal webbing and iron deficiency anemia. It is a rare condition and is also known as the Patterson Brown Kelly syndrome. It is highly associated with iron deficiency anemia and is thought to be a precancerous condition of the esophagus. The exact cause of this disorder is unknown. Genetics and nutritional deficiency have been associated with it and it is also speculated to be an autoimmune disorder. But nothing as of now is confirmed as the cause. Looking at the risk factors, it affects more women than males and is found in the age range of 40 to 70 years old. People of white ethnicity are more frequently affected than the other ethnic groups. Since this disorder is predominantly esophageal, persons suffering from plummer vinson syndrome suffers from intermittent difficulty in swallowing, especially with solid food. This thus indicates that there is usually only a partial blockage of the esophagus in this condition. The person may feel difficulty in breathing, which may exhibit itself as choking spell. They also tend to have tachycardia, which is increased heart rate, weakness, paler, and coelinitia, which is spoon-shaped nails, which are all the signs and symptoms of iron deficiency anemia. Patient may also have angular chelitis and glossitis, which is inflammation of the tongue. Coming to the diagnostic study, a complete blood count and iron studies including serum iron, ferritin, saturation of iron will be done to understand the severity of iron deficiency anemia and the extent of the condition. Studies like barium swallow, videos fluoroscopy, esophagogastroduodenoscopy all helps in direct visualization of the esophagus and helps detect esophageal webbing. Treatment for plummer vinson syndrome includes treatment for iron deficiency anemia and esophageal dilation. In treating for iron deficiency anemia, the occult or overt blood loss is ruled out along with any underlying malignancies or iron malabsorption. 150 to 200 mg of iron supplement is usually started for the correction of iron deficiency anemia. Iron supplement alone can also relieve dysphagia once the iron deficiency is treated with resolution of symptoms within 6 months. The patient usually undergoes esophageal dilation to relieve from dysphagia. Typically used techniques include endoscopic balloon dilatation or savory gallier dilators. If esophageal webs are left untreated in the long run, it can lead to complete dysphagia, aspiration pneumonia, and esophageal cancer. Though plummer vinson syndrome is not very well understood, it can be treated completely. For more such information, please do like and subscribe my channel.